um, myself is uma maheshwari uh, i did my phd uh, in dairy microbiology uh, um, in rasto i am an agricultural microbiologist i did my specialization in food microbiology so uh, my area of specialization like i am specialist in probiotic foods so whatever you are consuming like fermented milk products whatever you are consuming it has got lot many health benefits uh without knowing the health benefit of such fermented uh, probiotic products or fermented milk product we are consuming it like normal milk saapradha vida if you are consuming it as a fermented product like curd cheese paneer and mari ninga consume padrappa you will have lot many health uh, health benefits i am going to say a brief about uh, uh like how it is been prepared and what are the benefits of such fermented milk products and what are the milk products apart from the uh, list which you have known and uh, what is probiotic and how it is influencing our lifestyle and health okay so uh, to start with uh, first slide please so uh, dairy products they are uh, also called as cultured dairy products or fermented milk products as we are adding microbial culture it will be more of microbiology okay so you know chemistry students but uh, as i am a microbiologist it will be uh, like uh, a basic microbiology aspect i won't go deep into the subject i will say basic about uh, the science behind uh, these fermented milk products if you have any doubts you can stop me anywhere and you can ask the doubts okay so uh, as we are adding the culture culture is nothing but the microbial or microorganisms which are adding to the milk is called as culture that is why we are calling fermented milk products as culture dairy products why we are going for fermented milk product why we need to consume curd rather than a milk probiotics apart from that which one is beneficial whether to drink milk or whether to have a curd why a formal discussion mari irukum okay if you know you can answer or else i'll do why we need to consume curd uh, that is what is probiotic okay in addition to that you just sit and answer okay okay so generally it has got microorganism and those microorganism which is present in curd they are good to our health okay so it maintains our gut health gut health means generally in our intestine we will have lot many like from a total uh, body from tip to toe we have uh, we have been colonized with many microorganisms so uh, among that the most highly populated area is our intestine okay our digestive system is the most highly populated area and based on the population of microorganism which is being maintained in our gut our mental health and whole our um, overall health of a human being is being decided okay nam enna saapramo adha poruthu dhaan nammoda gut bacteria vandu change aagudhu based on the presence and type of organism whichever is present in our gut it decides your mental health neenga sogama irkinga na adha unga microbial change edho aayirukku nu artham intestinal organismathila if you are happy if your mood is good then there is some change in the microbial load everything is been decided by other gut microbiota i think this must be new for you uh, that is why intestinal organ means uh, microbiota or the organism which is present in the gut it is referred as second brain okay our first brain it is been controlled by the second brain it is also called as hidden organ nam intestine vandu hidden organ solranga because now only the science is been growing the presence of microorganism which is Uh, been dominated or which has been colonized in our gut it decides the mood or mental health of a human being okay so number fermented products good bacteria are fermented product healthy and you will be healthy okay 